Yo, we are doing a Hobby Lobby load. <laughs> I don't know what it is, but I ain't finna touch it. <laughs> and some shit. <laughs> Loading the truck. So it's like a delivery and then pickup at the same time. So you gotta buzz down soon as he signs. Rolex, baby. Rich hot, bitch hot, clock hot. Hit it to the mouth, full going shop. I see you, nigga. Real hood, baby. Life was all fucking crazy. What is up, YouTube, man? It's your boy, Color of the Things. I'm right here. At y'all with another damn banger. But by that title and that thumbnail, y'all already know what we about to get up into, gangy. Hey, right now, it is currently Sunday. So, y'all see how we just did that last load, right? This last load that I had just uploaded for y'all, right? I had just did that, right? So, boom. It's the weekend. To remind y'all, it's the weekend. So, y'all know I give y'all videos every single day, so I was expecting for them to give us another uh, load after we did that movie. You know what I'm saying? So, they gave us another load. Y'all, we are doing a Hobby Lobby load. <laughs> We're doing a Hobby Lobby load. This load got three stops. Today is, cur is the 10th, which is Sunday. We don't start the delivery time until Monday, but this is going to be an eat. I, I don't know. I don't want to pronounce it wrong, but Eastman. Eaton, Pennsylvania. So that's like eight, seven hours away. So we're gonna get there today. You know what I'm saying? Cause yesterday I was like, bro, like how y'all want me to do a delivery, but the start time for it ain't until you know Monday. So he was like, you know, half of the time they don't like you just sitting down. Like you forget, don't forget, we just now coming up for 35 hour reset. So I'm like, you know, I'm expecting for them to keep me moving, you know, moving and rolling, but that wasn't the case this time. So he was like, yeah, you're gonna have to make delivery Monday. So yeah, this load, it has three stops. So I have to stop at three Hobby Lobby stores, you feel me? So I'm gonna get to that first one today. You feel what I say? Well, I'm not doing the delivery. I'm just getting close by because why? The appointment time for this is 11. The second Hobby Lobby is 10. And I think like the other one is probably like 12. It depends because this, the last two, the last two stops are close together. The only one that's far is the first stop that I got is either, you know, Pennsylvania. But don't quote me on that because I don't know if I'm pronouncing it right because, you know, I was looking at it type shit, but. Yeah, that's all it is. Damn. Got these thick ass seals. All right, so I'm gonna have to go to a pilot because I'm getting tired of using like the little pliers that I got, bro. That shit, it, it's a hassle. You know, I'll be struggling, goddamn it, all oh, trying to, you know, open up the goddamn it on seals. It'll be taking me a minute. So with that being said, I'm gonna stop at a pilot because I know for sure a pilot gonna have the proper ply for me to cut barbed wire seals. So yeah, that's all it is. The thumb seals are thick as hell, y'all. Like literally thick. Is here. It'd be a hassle trying to get them goddamn things cut. But yeah, and that pretty motherfucker right here. Ha ha, hobby lobby. You hear me, hobby lobby. But yeah, yeah, that's basically all it is. So right now, uh, I got the paperwork. This is the paperwork right here. So you know, whoever put this here, you know, I don't know who put this here. Honestly, I don't know if it was a driver or like. You know, somebody who work at the Warner Yard, but there's no seals in here. So since there's no seals in here, most likely what they're going to do, right? Once, it's like Dollar General. It's like the Dollar General account. Because Dollar General, oh, yeah, they ain't even know where they got their Warner account. Uh, but yeah, it's just like the Dollar General account. So since it's like the Dollar General account, y'all remember like, with the Dollar General account, you had the seals. Though. With the Dollar General account, you had the seal. Matter of fact, no, I don't even think you had the seal. I think they put them shits on. I think they had the next seal. No, you had the next seal. They just had to watch you put it on. So boom, this is the only thing that's different between this look, this one and this one is that once I go to that first store, right, they gonna have to give me the seal to the next store. You feel what I'm saying? So like, since it's three stops, that first stop is gonna be just like the Dallas General Council. So take notes, you feel me? So boom, you pull up to that first store, right? You be like, boom, boom, boom. You here for one, you know, you doing your first stop with dude. They're gonna unload it or you unload it. You know, Dollar General, you unload. So y'all know that for a fact. So boom, I don't know how this Hobby Lobby shit is, but I know for a fact I'm not touching shit. You feel me? <laughs> you hear me? So that first stop, right? So boom, once they get you unloaded, right? They either gonna watch you put the seal on or you put the seal on. You feel what I'm saying? Well, they're gonna do both. They're gonna watch you put the seal on or they just gonna be like, you know what, huh? Here's the seal, you put it on yourself and they go on about your day. So that's basically all it is. So they're gonna give me the seal to the first load. I mean to the second load and then once i do i go to the second one they're gonna give me that and i they get done loading that one they're gonna give me that seal to the last one you know what i'm saying then that's when i just come back and we're now i'm at the columbus ohio drop yard you feel me i'm at the columbus ohio drop yard so for people who know you know you hear what i'm saying i'm here so after i do all of those loads we gotta come back here and drop this trailer off i really don't know why i was like bro it just feel like people on the hobby lobby account uh, why the fuck they giving me happy life loads? So I guess they must be needing help. You feel what I'm saying? But I was like, you know, I wasn't expecting it to be this long. Why? Because yesterday, right? Like, once I found, I stopped, I did, 
you know, my 10 hour break at a rest area, right? So I just shut down there. I was 54 miles away from here. And I was just like, bro, you know, I was just brushing it off the truck. I was like, you know, it's a Hobby Lobby load. It's probably close together. So I, I was like, you know, let me look it in the GPS first. I looked it up. That first stop was like eight, seven, eight, eight, seven hours away. I said, oh, fuck no, we gonna be using this time for Sunday. We gonna get there so that we could be there on time Monday. You feel what I'm saying? Cause the first appointment time is at eight. You know what I mean? But yeah, that's basically all it is. You feel me? So your boy doing that Hobby Lobby account. So let's go ahead and just, uh, uh, do what we gotta do. I'm gonna put the landing gear up. Uh, put the wires on. I literally just came here with an empty. You know what I'm saying? I think I, I forgot which one it was, but it's it's one of them motherfuckers. But yeah, it's one of them. But I dropped the empty here, so we got this Hobby Lobby trailer. So hey, we on the Hobby Lobby count today. You feel what I'm saying? Well, well today and tomorrow. You feel what I'm saying? So ain't no telling what they're gonna give us after that. So y'all already know what it is. But like I be saying, you could tell like when you're over the road, you could tell when you're helping a certain account. Like you can, I could tell when I'm on a Walmart account because they're gonna keep on routing me back to the same place. Walmart, Walmart, Walmart. I can tell when I'm helping a Walmart account. I can tell when I'm helping a Hobby Lobby account. You feel what I'm saying? So, yeah, you feel me? One thing I never do is help that Dollar General account. Fuck that. <laughs> Facts. But anyway, let's go ahead and get this motherfucking video started. Matter of fact, oh, I forgot to tell y'all. That's how I'm, I'm starting a video today, which is Sunday, but we're going to finish it tomorrow, which is Monday. You feel what I'm saying? So, we're just getting the intro out the way. Letting everybody know what's going on. You know, letting y'all know what's going on and shit. You know what we got going on. And, yeah. So, we're going to start it Sunday and it's going to finish Monday. So, y'all already know what it is. Y'all make sure you like, comment, subscribe, turn on all post notification bells. And, hey, let's get this movie started. Okay. Gang. Yeah, y'all. So, like, the shit that they trip about on a dollar general account i don't really know much about the hobby lobby account but i know the dollar general account the shit that they trip about over there they don't trip about over the road so like when it comes to like the dollar general account you got to really thoroughly pre-trip thoroughly thoroughly pre-trip and have to do proper trip planning when you're on the dollar general account and the hobby lobby account i know that for sure you know what i'm saying because those appointment times you have to meet those appointment times for real you know what i'm saying because it'd be other trucks you know from different companies going over there so you have to really be like really do trip planning so with this one you know we doing proper trip planning because you know it's sunday we not doing nothing so only thing we're going to do today is we're going to be straight driving just to get us too closer to the store so we could be able to make the appointment time tomorrow you find what i'm saying so which is eight in the morning so that's all it is but that was general account you have to thoroughly do your trip planning over there and on top of that like on top of uh, your trip planning right Y'all have to get a, a, a app or something so you can look at the satellite, right? Because when you're looking at the satellite, whoa, y'all, am I bugging? Or is this in the ground? Yeah, that's in the concrete, bro. Ain't no, that ain't coming out. I don't know what it is, but I ain't finna touch it. <laughs> and, and some shit. <laughs> you feel what I'm saying? <laughs> but anyway, back to what I was saying to y'all. So like you gotta get an app, right? Get an app with a satellite. So when you're doing these, like you get a logo, right? All since you're going to like these small stores with small lots, I always make sure you do your trip planning as far as like going on a satellite. Okay, seeing what you're working with before you get there, and you have a surprise. You know what I'm saying? So okay, boom, you're going on a satellite. Okay, that's I can see. I I can pull in from here, look in the back just to see exactly if they have a proper dock. Cause the Dollar General account, they don't have docks at all. Only thing you got to do is look at where the side door is and you're straight. You feel what I'm saying? So you might have to blind side back or drive side back. You never know. You feel what I'm Especially with the Dell General account, you never know. So with this one, I had looked on the satellite just to see like entrances, you know, and everything. And I had seen the entrance for the first one, the second one, and the third one. So I was like, okay, I'm good. I know what I'm, you know, at least I'm no, you know, premeditating what I'm expecting. You feel what I'm saying? But uh, let me get my, my hammer. Uh, you might see this. Y'all be acting like I don't be paying attention to y'all in the comments. Uh, what's his name, Chef? Uh, uh, what's your name? I think I don't want to say your name wrong, but Tracy, I've been seeing your ass. You know what I'm saying? Prom don't want that smoke with me. You know what I'm saying? I'll be seeing you. Y'all be acting like I know you're paying attention. I'll be paying attention, dude. Prom, I say what I say. Swift, I say what I say. Western Express, y'all already know what it is. Y'all can't even talk to me. <laughs> Y'all know what it is. But yeah, I'll be seeing y'all comments, bro. So look, Tracy, I got the hammer. You hear me? So y'all be acting like I don't be paying y'all no mind. I'll be paying y'all some mind. You feel what I'm saying? It just with, with the negative motherfuckers, I'm not doing that shit. You feel what I'm saying? I'm done addressing them motherfuckers. You never win with a negative nigga. <laughs> like for real, like you'll never win with a miserable motherfucker. But hey, we completed our job. 
because we made another hater mad about what we got going on. You hear me? So, yeah, you feel me? That's basically all it is. Just letting y'all know that I be paying attention to y'all. So we pretty check the trailer. Let me get that license plate number because I don't want them tripping on me. Yeah, no, yeah, no. Oh, this is an Oklahoma. Okay. Okay, okay. But yeah, that's all it is, y'all. So we about to go ahead and get the uh, submit the paperwork and get the uh, and get the uh, get the get the get the and get the uh, 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 get the what? Uh, uh, uh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But y'all already know what it is. So let's go ahead and submit that paperwork and get on this motherfucker road, gang. Uh, I just got off the phone with dispatch, right? You know, a cool dude. The first time I ever spoke to a cool person on dispatch for the weekend crew. Excellent, like, good fucking guy. You feel what I'm saying? He actually gave me actual details about this. Because, y'all, when I opened the paper, uh, you know, like the bill of lading little, you know, little thing I had. Because this is like, this is the Warner's, you know, bill of lading uh, paper envelope. You feel what I'm saying? This is the envelope for the bill of lading. So, I opened it and it's only... You know, one sheet, so I didn't know. So when I called, right, he was explaining it to me. I asked him, like, to exactly explain, like, how, you know, I'm supposed to be doing, you know, this low because, you know, I'm used to, you know, how the Dollar General account was. Like, once I get done low, get uh, live unloaded there, I have another seal ready to put on the trailer and head to the next store. But this is not the case this time. So basically, what we're doing is we're going to be delivering. And I, I would think I was saying that, uh, that first spot wrong. I think it's called Exton. Exton, Pennsylvania. Yeah, Exton. I was saying Pennsylvania. I forgot. I, like, I don't know what the fuck I was saying, but yeah, the first stop is Exton. You know, Pennsylvania. It's a Hobby Lobby, right? So I will be delivering there. They're going to be the ones delivering on, you know, on un live unloading the whole truck. So after we do those two, right, we're going to be going and uh, taking the trailer is going to be empty at that. Point. I don't know if it's going to be all the way empty, but I don't know. But I know for a fact. Let's just say it's gonna be empty, right? So after they get done live unloading that, we're going to the second stop, which is in Lancaster, Pennsylvania. They're going to be loading the truck. So it's like a delivery and then pickup at the same time. So I'm doing a delivery and a pickup at the same time. You feel what I'm saying? So that first stop, I'm gonna deliver. Second stop, I'm picking up. And then the third stop, I'm picking up. And I'm gonna take the trailer. I'm gonna bring the trailer back here. So I don't need a seal for any of that. You find out saying the last two stops, I don't need a seal because they already know what's going on. So I was like, okay, cool, because you know, it's the one sheet. It wasn't helping me, you know, not, 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 not a bit. But I'm just letting y'all know what's the changes to the load. So, you know, I don't really think, I don't know if this is how the lobby, a uh, hobby lobby account is the whole time. Like, what you just delivering, picking up, picking up. It might, you know, might change here and there, varies depending on how the day is. You find out what I'm saying? Or what the store needs, or what the store wants, or what one needs. I don't know. But that's basically all it is. So, right now, we are currently. <laughs> 452 miles away you feel what i'm saying so it's estimated for us to get there around 1850 which is 16 is 4 hey hey now hey now hey now 16 is 4 17 is 5 18 is 6 17 is 19 or 19 is 17 wait what i confused my damn self dumbass motherfucker six is four me 16 is 4, 17 is 5, 18 is 6, 19 is 7. Okay, so it's estimated for us to get there around like 7 shut down. You know, I ain't gonna go all the way there. I'm just gonna get close to it and then I'm gonna shut down and then we're gonna run it back early in the morning. You feel what I'm saying? So we're gonna run it back early in the morning. So we got us a long days ahead of us. So let's go ahead and get on this motherfucking road, bro. I love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Man, hey, I'll see y'all out there, motherfucker. On gang. And if y'all don't see me later on, y'all see me tomorrow morning when we're doing the load well matter of fact i think matter of fact now nah, we're gonna stop at a pilot though we're gonna stop at a pilot and get actual pliers for the load and then matter of fact fuck that they they, they i think they got some i think they, they should have some they should have some but yeah let's get on this road on game <laughs> Yes, sir.
fat boy. Side of the building, the lady, like, bro, it was like so perfect timing, right? Because the moment it was like eight o'clock, right? I'm saying I'll shut down right beside the building, you feel me? So it was perfect timing. The moment I pulled my curtains back, she's literally standing in front of the truck. <laughs> I'm like, damn, I was just about to come in there, you feel what I'm saying? So, you know, perfect timing. So she want me to pull up, you know what I'm saying? Uh, she gonna pop the seal for me, and then I'm gonna back into the first dock, and then you know, to that next dock. So, so let me do this right quick. Try to get this back video for y'all and then I'll be right back with y'all, okay? All right, child, so right now I'm about to back. She just popped the seal for me, so it took us a minute to get the seal off because they use the same little pliers that I use, but she taught me like a little trick, you feel what I'm saying, to pop the seal with it. So I was like, shit, you know what I'm saying, they teach me something. But anyway, let's get this back in video for y'all right quick. And we about to got thing on, yeah, I'll get back with y'all, okay? So even when I evened up the trailer and everything, it still looked like I was off. So that's why I pulled up so many times. But yeah, that's basically all it is right now. So we just waiting, put on a finish live unloading us, and then we're out of here. So y'all know what that, what that means. You feel me? Because I had to pull all the way up over there, but that's like a little mini parking area for cars. Good chair, y'all. That one. over there. I had to pull all the way in because her mind, I came in from that way last night while I was originally supposed to come from the back way. You find what I'm saying? But hey, we got hey, we got our asses in here because when we came in last night, I pulled all, I pulled, literally came in from this way, looped in and backed all the way into, into the alley on the side that we just came from. You feel me? Shut down right there. And then this morning, same thing. We just backed right back into the dock. You feel me? So that's basically all it is. This is the, the life of the Hobby Lobby account, you feel what I'm saying? The Hobby Lobby account, it seems kind of chill. Uh, I ain't gonna lie, like, it seems chill. <laughs> you feel me? You just deliver into the stores, you ain't gotta do much, you feel me? So, yeah, nah, I fucks with it. I fucks with it, I fucks with it, I fucks with it. Because I remember, y'all remember, I don't know if y'all do for the people who's new, we had uh, had an ECM trailer, you feel what I'm saying? So that was like, y'all know Warner bought the uh, company, the ECM uh, trucking company, you feel what I'm saying? So, they, I think Warner got Baylor and ECM. So, I was like, okay. You feel me? So, I had to deliver one of those before, you feel what I'm saying? We had three stops as well. But this, like, the difference between this uh, this one and that one is we had to deliver to all three stores. We're delivering to this store and picking up from two, the last two stores. So, that's how that goes. But, on top of that, we didn't even have to start our clock. We're still in sleep over, you feel me? Still in sleeper birth. That's hey. Matter of fact, let me go ahead and start that now. You know what I'm saying? So we <laughs> you feel me? But yeah, yeah, everybody know like if you don't move the truck over five miles per hour, it won't kick it into drive. Literally won't. So we did that. Still got time to spare. So got us a long day. It's gonna be an eight hour eight, nine hour drive. Well probably I don't know. Depending on how, how far we are. But it's gonna be a little a eight hour drive back to Ohio just to drop this trailer off. So that's how it goes. But once they get done, I will get back with y'all. Good. All right, guys. So they just got done unloading us. 
So I'm about to see what the trailer looked like. Yeah, that's it. Oops. About to see if that motherfucker up there or not. Looks like we, I hope we ain't got to get on level ground just to close the door. What it looks like. Oh, yeah. They emptied the whole thing. So now what we got to do after this, we're on our way back to what we about to do now is get on our way to the second store and go pick up whatever they need us to pick up. And then after that, we're gonna go to that third store. So, I already submitted the information and everything into the you know the system, so I'm still hooked to the trailer. Oh shit. I almost lost my soul. Oh my god. But anyway, yeah, I'm about to, uh, I already done got it in the GPS and everything, so what I'm going to do is look on the satellite, just to see, like, if it's a dock or anything, so I can know when I'm expecting before I get there, because I, I know, god damn it, I hurt myself this morning, but yeah, I'm about to look on the satellite just to see what it looks like, like the driveway and everything, just to make sure, you know, it ain't no, you know, crazy type of thing, I can know which way I'm pulling in from, which way I'm pulling in to, yeah, so let's go ahead and head to the next door. Okay. tell y'all my done land right so that was the back right there this is the first store that we're at right we're picking up so that's done you know i just backed into the dock they loaded me with the stuff that i needed y'all this is a clean up so i'm basically like just picking up the trash and the boxes and stuff that they you know because basically like, when stuff like that happens that means that like okay like they need to you know they're overwhelmed with like trash and they need like as far as boxes and they need to get them out they use the uh trailers to get them shits out so anyway y'all Tell me why I pulled up to the third. I was following the GPS on my phone rather than the co-pilot because I, it slipped my mind because I thought that I already had put the first address, I mean the second store address in my phone. So I'm following that GPS. Yeah, I literally went six miles past the first store to go to the third store. <laughs> but at least I know what the fuck I'm expecting there. You feel what I'm saying? Because, bro, what the hell? You feel me? I was like, bro, what? And the total hell, bro. Like, and then I came here. I didn't even know which dock is what because it's like it's like a town center where like it's so a lot of stores collided together. So I didn't know which dock was what. I'm calling these motherfucker like hey, I'm calling my dispatch. I don't know what's going on. You gotta help. Me. You feel what I'm saying? So she trying to make stuff shake for me, all that shit. But okay, so they loaded me now. And yeah, so we got one more stop after this. Then after that, I seen the Audis over there. I think I might hit that Audis up right quick. Feel me? Hit it up, you know, get a couple of things out of there, and then we're gonna be on our way. So, with that being said, see how they Okay. So, so, they literally just got done putting, uh, you know, the boxes and stuff that they needed in the trailer. I just got done closing it. So, let me give y'all the, run the rundown of everything that's about to go on at the third store. So, when I went there the first time, right, when I told you that I had accidentally went there before I had came here, well, when I went there, it was a trailer in their dock. So, I was like, okay, if it's a trailer in your dock, how in the hell y'all want me to do this? So I, I went ahead, like, when it was uh, doing this, I called them. I was like, look, uh, y'all on my next stop. And I was like, as far as that, what y'all want me to do? I figured it, it was, they was going to have, you know, what I was thinking. What I was thinking in the first place, I knew they was going to have me do. So basically what they want me to do when I get there, right, y'all? When I went there, y'all, good thing that I went there so I know what to expect. I know which way to go now. I know which way to pull in from. I know which way to leave from. So when I get there, right, it is so tight, y'all, because it's, it's the same as this one, just tighter. You feel what I'm saying? So it, it got a Walmart right beside it and a couple more stores. As soon as I get there, right, I'm going to pull into the lot. 
and then I'm gonna make that right, I'm gonna bust it right, right? And then it's gonna be cars all over the place, but there's enough space for me to get around the building. So as soon as I get around there, what I have to do is drop the trailer that I got now, and then I'm gonna have to uh, bobtail go get that trailer that's in their dock, put that, uh, you know, move that somewhere else. You feel me? So as soon as I get that trailer, I'm gonna get that, boom, bust that. Uh, uh. You hear what I'm saying? Move that motherfucker up a little bit, and then get my back on my trailer, get that motherfucker, and then back into the dock, get loaded, and then pull out, and then get, you know, then pull out, and then as soon as I pull out, I'm gonna have to uh, drop the trailer, and then get that other trailer that they had in the dock the first time, and then put that back in the dock, and then we about to get this trailer again, then we're going, the next stop gonna be a TA, a few stations in Columbus, Ohio, but... Yeah, that's basically all that's going on. So I'm giving y'all the gif of what's about to go on. You feel what I'm saying? So I'm going to get some clips of it because me, I'm just trying to get this shit out the way. I'm not going to lie. But I'm going to get y'all the best clips I can. You know what I'm saying? So let's go ahead and get to this though because I told them I'd be there in 20 minutes. So I'm only 6.5 minutes away. So let's go ahead and get over there. Okay. All right, y'all. So right now I'm currently right here. So I'm not going to be talking to y'all as much. You feel what I'm saying? So I'm about to just talk to y'all now and get everything out the way right now. So what I'm about to do is drop the trailer. Get this. This is what it looked like. You feel what I'm saying? It's very tight. Very tight. And it's a whole container over there. It's just a lot, y'all. So, I'm gonna record everything. It's just, I'm not gonna be talking with y'all. I'm gonna just speed it up and y'all see it. You feel me? So, let me go ahead and get started on that. This is what I mean by tight. This, this is what I mean by tight. So what I'm about to do is couple up to this one, and what I'm gonna do, right? Hold on, I'm gonna show y'all right quick. I'm gonna show you. So, yeah, see how the trailer is right there? I just dropped that one. I'm gonna take this one, pull it up, and then back it up right beside it. Pull it, hey, I'm gonna back that. I'm gonna take this one, pull up, back it up right beside that one. Alright y'all, so after I did a hassle with me getting the damn trailer in here, only reason why it was taking me so many like so long to back up y'all, you literally have to even it out. Like it's not no oh you can get it in halfway how you want to. No, you really have to even it out. You can tell, you feel what I'm saying? So like I had to get it closer to the container in order for me to goddamn get it all the way into the dock. You feel what I'm saying? I was halfway in there, like it is See, I was even on one side, but I wasn't even on the other side. So I had to really like keep on pulling up just to get it all uh, even. But right now, what I'm about to do is put y'all down so I can be able to call them and let them know that I'm, you know, I'm ready to, you know, yeah. And then I get back with y'all on okay? So they just got done, you know, loading the trailer and everything. So what I'm about to do is pull up. Now this time, right, what I'm going to do, I'm not going to pull up and then back the trailer back up that way. What I'm going to do, I'm going to pull out and I'm going to go all the way up because I got to exit this way anyway. So I'm going to drop the trailer down there you feel what i'm saying so the only thing i have to do is come back get that get that trailer get their trailer back into the dock and then pull back up there get our trailer then we out of here you feel what i'm saying so that being said let's go ahead and get this shit started on So right now we are currently at the damn fuel station. So uh, I put it in the GPS. We are literally two hours away from the drop yard in Columbus. So we're gonna be getting there tonight and shutting down at the drop yard. You feel what I'm saying? And on top of that, we got us a pre-assigned load. So most likely it's probably gonna be at the Columbus, Ohio drop yard too as well because I seen it was like the start well the delivery, like the pickup was in Columbus. So I'm pretty sure it's probably gonna be like a split. So yeah, but that being said, uh, I literally just got done getting fuel, so let me hurry up because I'm operating off of my 14 hour DOT. So let me hurry up and get this out the way, and then next time y'all see me, we'll be at the drop yard on gang. So, so right now, we're currently at the, we're back at the yard, you feel what I'm saying? So we only had us an hour left. Yeah, I hope so. What we're about to do is get this back, and that's gonna be the end of the damn video. So let me go ahead and back this trail up right quick, and I'll get back with y'all in the game.
All right, so this is gonna be the end of the damn video, bro. We got the back, man. It's 34 out this motherfucker. It's cold and everything, but we got us another little bit. We ain't gonna get to that till tomorrow, but y'all don't know what it is. So y'all make sure like, comment, subscribe to the all post notification bells. And hey, I'll see y'all next movie. Oh, okay. <laughs>